Yo guys, I am here with my buddy Gyro. We're doing a very interesting video. We just got done testing it, and I'm actually overwhelmed by the what's happening. So he's running the current meta team. This is variable, like it does change, but the most common team right now is uh, Trader Melee, Gother, The One, and Goddess Liz. This is the most common meta team, right? You'd agree to that? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, there's some variations of it, but it's just mainly this team. So what I am doing is I'm running base Valenti with UR gear and geared. Uh, this is geared going against his team. Uh, the whole yeah. idea about this is to not die turn one or not die ever. And honestly, against this team, it seems to work. But against other teams, we'll test that too, because I'll, I'll go against the Bond team. We'll see what we can do. But uh, against this team, it does seem to be actually quite impressive. So we're going to go ahead and play this match, and uh, yeah, tell me your thoughts on what's your idea for trying to kill me with this current team lineup. Like, I, I I don't, I just got to kill, I got to kill Lilia, and your Mono's Corrosion's going to kill me. I actually don't know how I can win. I have to get all from the fucking Meliodas. That's it. I, I don't know how I can win. I really don't. I I think I'm fucked. Even, even, to, if there, here's the thing, Valenti, I always say, oh yeah, her damage is not that great, but, but the fact that she's actually able to damage your the one is impressive to me. Because he's common. He's a very common character. Yeah. Oh wow, that's actually good. I, uh, I think I can kill you, but it's only because I'm using a level 3 card. With who? Eliotis. <laughs> guess we'll find out, huh? Wait, you only, that's your one, <laughs> that's, that's one attack, though. I know. Oh my... Mm. That's, that's oh he lived so we're, we're just not gonna talk about how that didn't kill you <laughs> he had almost max passive oh god i'm gonna save this one actually and go i'm gonna use a, le a level three pierce card so you can also laugh at that because that's gonna do like nothing <laughs> at least in theory it should not even kill you oh i just kill him no i'm well the one is dead yes before... I don't care about him. He said he's 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 not gonna hurt your green units. <laughs> uh yeah, no, no, he's irrelevant here. That motherfucker ain't doing nothing. So just by having Valenti doing nothing, well, because technically speaking, she is literally doing nothing, right? You'd agree that she's just yeah. here. I mean, yeah, she's, no, she's, she's just here. She's here doing she's like things Keo. through your stats. She's a stat control. I, I guess it's like yeah, she's Keo. but less broken. Hmm. I have to kill. I have to kill your goddess Liz. I'm assuming. I'm not really that. Well, he crit there. Congrats. You hit it, champ. Oh, this this will do that damage though, right? That was a level three Pierce card, by the way, right? That was level three. Confirm. I think that was level three. This. Just go with that for now. By the corrosion, you have almost your full stacks on your rare melee. It looks. Like. I think he does have full stacks. Okay, so that was a level three Pierce card with him having full stacks. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it did eighty k. Usually, that would Just do pathetic. on a normal team a lot more. It, cool. it it would kill the field pretty much. Yeah. That would. So my thing is, can I one-shot your Assault Melee at full passive if I just slightly decrease your stats? Oh, that's annoying. This should be patience. Yeah. At least I'm immune to being that. Oh, wow. Well. I think I can still break it. So what we're going to do is... This should break it. Then we go like this. And then we go like this. Oops. I actually don't know how I can win. I don't think there's a way with this current team setup I can win. Wow. I have to she, rush Meliodas' ultimate without attacking you at all. She had, he had oh. full passive and she crit. She actually crit. Oh, that's... Well, and that's gross. So she's making she's making Mono crit more consistently. Because usually Mono would never crit a melee like that. Like, not that many times. I just want to see. There, there's no way she patience an ultimate, right? Oh, uh, that I'd die laughing. Did no damage though. Did prepared. nothing. Watch patience. Oh, it did. Did 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 five k. Ironically, a whole hand is literally blank. 
literally. You, you just yeah, I, I I got I got obliterated. All right, let's do that's that's amazing. So for the current meta team, this is probably better than MK2 for this current meta, right? Yeah, probably. yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. I, I slept on her a little bit. I do think her her holy relic isn't as good because her ultimate, her, like it's a rupture ultimate, which is good in theory, single target. But her base stats don't really, you know, she's wearing she's wearing HP defense, so the damage she's gonna do with her ult's not really that important. Yeah, but it does help do more than what she would do. So I guess her relic would have value here. So I can see why this is pretty good. See, the thing is, if you're running MK2, I actually have a chance to win. That's the difference. I cannot win with in this current setup. I need a oh oh your Valenti's gonna die to my power strike because <laughs> I do more damage to resistance. Uh, it is a problem. No, uh, not really. I didn't draw it. I didn't draw what I wanted. Uh, I couldn't patience any of my cards purely because of their effect. Uh, is that the Pierce one, or is that the, uh, Sever? That, that's Sever. Okay, so the one with all the blades, too. Okay. Now I have to figure out a way to break this stupid thing. Honestly, let's go like this. Let me just cleanse. Actually, I, I think I can break that shield with Lenti by herself. Is that brave to say? Should be able to break it with a, uh, Sever card. Try that out. Let's break it. Um, I think your king has a chance to die here. Nope. Not close at all, right? Hmm. To be fair, your king is doing a lot less damage. Like, usually, well... I don't know. Do you feel like you're doing less damage? Yeah. I feel like... Oh, okay. He obliterates her, though. Yeah. But his power strike, he actually disintegrates her. So, this, the power strike part, I didn't really notice any difference, but the sever is doing, like, nothing. Can I stack what Valenti's thing? No, you cannot lower defense really except twice. But it, what if it's a level 1 and a level 2? It will not work. I should have no. that in the reverse order. I'm dead either way. No, I mean, thankfully, I don't have any king cards, so it doesn't really matter. The power strike does mess her up, so Terry ult will just obliterate her. Yeah. Oh, she does have a rupture ult, but like the thing is, it sucks, she, so it's not gonna kill. Her. I would have a chance. I would have actually probably had a chance to win this match. If my Margaret was on attack crit, but I'm a disgusting human who cares about CC. The Jean HP. She's it's gonna do like nothing. Yeah, but she doesn't kill you. Yeah, but uh, I, I just wanted to kill your Lilia. I see that. It, uh, it did work. So my best chance. That's is not. Here. You're not. You're a bully. I'm being bullied. This is my best chance of killing it. Oops, sorry. I mean, there's one team that's going to obliterate you, and that's the Bond team. But everything else you should have a really good chance against. This is a 4 6. You know, that's not bad. It's not great, but yeah. it's not bad. Yeah, it's not, not If that bad. was 6-6, six, six, it would have killed you. But to be fair, you buffed I mean, it was 5-6, it would have killed built to counter buffs. Okay, I, I, I may have slept on her slightly too much. I may have... I like her. I, I may have just slightly, just... Slightly, ever so slightly. <laughs> and, could, could you kill my Gother, please? But... Thank you. But why? Go but why? Maybe because I don't have bond cards. That sounds and like maybe that's my only chance at winning. Sounds like a personal problem. It might be. It might be a personal problem, but you know, you could you could help me with that. How good do you think she'd be good against the goddess team? Uh, she would actually affect Armio pretty much. Armio wouldn't do much damage. But... I mean, he already doesn't. Bam. I already tanked his 6 6 ult. What about, what about... Uh, I guess he's better Sario than... wouldn't get affected, really. You know? At all? I don't think Sario would take that much, like, of a hit. 
think the play is that we do this. Hey, you're gonna kill my bond. I'm only yeah. because his defense relates. I like this card a lot. Her defense lowering card is really pog. Yeah. Because I crit now. I crit. And, you crit. You're and, and to confirm, you do have Holy Relic and you are what's your alt level? 6-6. Six, six. So your typical broken bond. I think you, I think I I think I need to put Valenti up in the tier list now. I think I need to redo the tier list and up her. But yeah, I think I, I think I underplayed her. To be fair. I got this. I got ghost here. I'm vibing. Okay. I won. This this is fun for me. It's not it's All not right. often that you can design a team to go second and actually like laugh at your opponent. You know, it's not like that's not really the case with this meta. It's either you go first or lose. But with this team. You go first and you laugh. Yeah. Yeah. You, you should go first, yeah? No, I go I first. Go. Well, let's be cool. Well, you're, you have King in the back. I'm running Twigo. No, I'm switching that. Uh oh. I'm running Twigo. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I want to go second, anyways. Okay, so. I check your unit. So you have Holy Relic. You have a full Holy Relic team. Full Holy Relic. Yeah. Yeah, I have even Twigo. That's the relic. Interesting. So the meta team right now, well, I think either either Valenti's work, but this one's more defensive. But the thing is, I can still technically win against this team with my MK team. I hate that you have Arthur Holy Relic. That makes it so much more annoying. My turn one draw wasn't that great, though. There's nothing- I have to kill Arthur. Unless you draw two Lily as single targets, I don't think you can. I'm gonna play like I normally- Aries the biggest threat in this. Okay. Yeah, it's good damage. Let's go You have the thing is, will the defense lowering help fight through your taunt? Uh, probably not. That's a problem. I mean, it will. I mean, in theory, we'll do more damage, but I doubt it'll matter. But in execution, probably not. I wish I had more AoEs. That would have been definitely helpful. Yeah. Arthur is fun to fight. <laughs> it's so fun. Oh, I know. Uh, Wow, I have a really good hand if I abuse it. Very interesting. Because you're going to be able to rush Terry Alt and win the game. Wait, did you not? Wait a second. That's two taunts. So if I... I could kill Terry here, maybe. But if I did this... Actually, this is 30%. You're sorry I lowered. So I'm just gonna hope you can live. I mean, I can live. I'm just gonna hope and pray. Trying something a little crazy. That's gonna hurt me a lot. You're gonna kill me. I only have one present. I'm dead. I'm 100% dead. No, no, not. Oh, I underestimated Terry. I don't have buff removal. I think I'm uh, dead, I have though. three stances. I won. Yeah, I have three stances. Mm -hmm. That's death. But I mean, that's, that's Terry for you. It's defense. Everyone dead? <laughs> no, Mon is always the last of us. I mean, yeah, she did live until the end. Alright, so Bond team. Still not fun for me. In that match, it was the Terry team. No, yeah, I, I agree. It is the Terry team. I... I I drew no Bond cards, so in that match, it was the Terry team. But that's what Terry does. It's like, he just wins the game. Bond's just there to support. I, I could I could technically run without Terry, but I mean, I, no, I think I would still I, probably win. Everyone wears, it wins against Terry. Uh, uh, everyone runs Terry. So yeah, that's I think that'll be good for this video. We went against all the three meta teams. There's the Goddess team, but that team... I think we'll win anyway. Oh, I think my team wins it anyway, because I always win against Goddess team. Carmiel does no damage. I guess I could run it once. Um, 
there's there's really no point. Uh, I already know my team would okay. win because the team's it's gonna be just a long, pointless game of me tanking ultimates and waiting until you finally burn out. It's just how it always is. It's like a twenty minute match, and it's so just obnoxious. But the three meta teams are Bond, King, and uh, Trader Melly, and this one actually held up really good against two of the three. I would say it held up good against two of the three. The fourth yeah, team would be Goddess team, but once again, my team be fine against it right it's not gonna like I, yeah, if i can win a mk2 against the goddess team this is no different and, and if anything yeah, lowering your well. defense so i'll just create more consistently so yeah valenti's this team's good uh this team is very good i'll show the team real fast it's gonna be mono with star Rail red link uh valenti with i i run you can run whatever link you want for her but i run base lilia for gear lilia with uh, red Meliodas, red demon Meliodas link, and then Easton with Tarmiel link, and I eat for a resistance food. And this team is great. I like it. I'm probably gonna get uh, Valenti's relic, not because it's good, but just because it gives you know more stats. It, it could be good in theory if they try to kill your Lily up turn one, and then you have a uh, rupture ult. But once again, her ult's only gonna be very necessary against buff units, which I guess Meli is a buff unit, Bond's a buff unit, Market's a buff unit, so there's value in her. Uh, I just wish she had a bit more going for her, but honestly, for 2022, I think she holds up to the standards for the Compassion team, so... Worth it. Yeah? You say she's worth it, too? Yeah. Yeah, you can build her. You want to have fun? She's actually really good, too. Mm -hmm. And she'll... Like, one of the best aging units ever. That bitch came out two years ago. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. There you guys go. Valenti base Valenti's good. Is she better than MK2? I think it's still situational base, depending on what you want to do, but she's definitely an option. Uh, thanks for watching guys, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.